This is the SR38, Star's latest addition to the SR family. The SR38 platen design is very similar to the SR20R4 design in the fact that it's a zero shaped yoke which ensures all the tools are very close to the guide bush. On this particular model we've got four fixed cross working spindles, ER20 capacity and we've got two modular stations at the top to accept our cartridge type tooling. In addition we've increased the number of front drilling tools from four to five and we've got a fully programmable B-axis unit that can do simultaneous five axis work on the main spindle or on the sub spindle. The SR38 also includes an independent X3 slide. This enables balance cutting between tools number 2 and 52 and 3 and 53. To simplify the programming of the X3 slide, tools number 52 and 53 are programmed from the Path 1 program. This ensures even balance cutting operations are very simple and effective to code. To maximise overlap capability, the SR38 includes an eight station back working platen. All the stations on the back working platen have a driven tool capability. Also included is the ability to use through tool coolant with the addition of eight outlets in the face of the platen. As standard, the machine comes high pressure coolant ready with a series of manifolds on the head one platen and two independent lines for high pressure coolant on the back working station. Also included as standard sub coolant flush. The clamping force is increased by uh, over 50% due to the addition of this hydraulic actuator, which we can adjust very easily by the adjusting knob in the corner here. As is the case with all star machines, the spindle power is ample with up to 11 kilowatts of power on the main spindle and 7.5 kilowatts on the sub spindle respectively. The maximum RPM on both is 7,000 revs per minute. The SR38 includes a stroke of 320 millimeters on head one. This however does not have a huge impact on the footprint of the machine which compared to an SR32J for example has only increased by just over 10%.